In 2022, the National Hockey League released its first diversity and inclusion report. It showed that work needs to be done as just under 5% of the league identifies as black. But as one member of the Knoxville Ice Bears tells Six on Your Side, Bo Williams, he hopes to help grow the games for minorities at all levels. When you're young, you dream about what could be. And when you're a youngster growing up in Canada, that dream can only mean one thing. Something about hockey is just, it's just different. Um, you just learn to love it so much. The first year Knoxville Ice Bear Troy Murray playing hockey at the professional level is a dream fulfilled. Wherever it takes you, you just know it's, you're, you're playing hockey. As a child growing up in Toronto, Murray tells us his inspirations were longtime Calgary Flame and Hall of Famer Jerome McGinley and one-time Nashville Predator P.K. Subban, both black players making an impact at the game's highest level. I remember watching a lot of P.K. Subban. He's a flashy player, but, you know, he's, he's strong. He's a good skater. He's got a hard slap shot. And while Subban and Aginlo were Murray's inspirations growing up, he now finds himself inspiring others. I volunteer back home. There's um, an organization called Seaside um, with Kirk Brooks, who's doing a lot of work there for, you know, underprivileged kids of color. And it's just, you know, growing the game for the diverse community and kind of letting them see what it's like and just kind of being a role model for them, saying that, you know, it's a possibility for you as well and kind of just make it more normal for them. But unfortunately, being black and playing hockey still isn't necessarily the norm. As a matter of fact, even today, racist comments still find their way into the game, whether it be from opposing fans or players. It's not, it's not common and it's not happening as much as I'm very thankful for, but um, it has happened when I was younger and I didn't know how to, you know, process these things. Yeah, it definitely took a toll on my emotional state. It's just ignorance and I don't need to react to it. It's, it doesn't need to exist anymore. What needs to exist are more opportunities for minorities. I think as time goes, you know, things will start to slowly change and uh, this sport will become more inclusive. Um, you know, minorities will be playing this game. I'm proud of who I am, I will say that. We have like a whole black community, like we all know each other because it's so small. Small for now, but growing as players like Murray hope to inspire other youngsters to keep dreaming of someday playing at the next level. Bo Williams, WATE, six on your side.